Let's go exploring with Daniel Cook, right here on the Veritable Quandary. This is Daniel Cook at a recycling plant. Hi, I'm here with Daryl, and today he's going to teach me how to, how to recycle paper, and maybe even let me drive this huge machine. Good morning, Daniel. Hi, how are Darryl. you today? Good. Good. This is Daniel Cook on a bike, in a plane, on a farm, playing games with many places and friendly faces. We'll have lots of fun with Daniel Cook. So Daniel, would you like to see how we uh, make uh, these old newspapers back into newsprint again? <laughs> Excellent. What we do is we take the old newspapers. What happens if the paper is ripped and, and you uh, make it into a cycle and you recycle it? There's a typical newspaper that we would use in our materials, and you can rip it, do whatever you'd like with it, and we can still use it. Ooh. All right. Then what we do is we add uh, water and some chemicals to that newspaper, and we make this into this pulpy slurry. It's kind of like a gray milkshake. See that in Except there. I wouldn't want to eat it. I, yeah, I wouldn't recommend that either. But what we want to do, though, is we need to clarify this. We need to make this uh, appear beige or close to white as we possibly can. So what we do is we send it through a couple different processes, and we remove this from it. This is a material that has the ink in it, like the black ink and the colored ink from the paper. We have to take that off of the paper uh, so that we can make it back into clean newsprint. Oh. Now, by the time we're done that, then we are at that. This is a version of what the acceptable material is to come over to the end of this machine. Hey, can we go outside and look at the big machines now? Definitely. One thing we'll have to do, though, before we go is we have to make sure you have all, all the safety equipment, OK? So we want to also protect your ears. And here's your safety vest. How heavy is that bin? That bin probably weighs pretty close to about half an elephant. There's about 15 to 1,600 kilos in that bin. Wow. All right. <laughs> there you go, Daniel. Daniel, this is Tony. A little Thanks. bit of a climb up here, isn't it? Okay. Have you ever been in a truck like this before? Well, I've been in something like this. It was my uh, grandfather's big oil truck. Hey, can I help you dump a bin into the truck? Sure, why not? Why don't you come around to the other side and hop in, and we'll I'll let you try it out. Okie dokie. He's going to let me sit in the passenger side. Oh, great. This is Daniel Cook lifting a recycling bin. Hey, Daniel. This here is just like a, a video game joystick. You push it down to bring the arms down, you can lift it backwards and it brings the arms up. You turn it to the right and it brings the forks down. Now when you come to the box, you got to bring the forks down so that you get into the pockets on the side so that you can dump it. You take it nice and slow. Safety is everything. And up we go. Well, this room here is uh, the paper warehouse. This is where we bring our trucks in from the Abitibi Paper Retriever Program, as well as the different municipalities come in and dump their paper here that we can run it up inside the building. Can we see Tony dump all the paper? Sure, let's go. Let's go over here, we'll have Tony. Okay. That's a lot of newspaper. Yeah. You've seen where we picked up the paper and then where the truck dumped and pushed it onto the conveyor belt. You want to go inside and see where we take all the ink off of the paper and then make it into new newspaper? Yeah. Excellent. We have to put our let's, earplugs in. Let's go. Yes, we do. So, Daniel, this is all the rejects and everything that once we've put the paper through the process, we've cleaned all of this out of it. So this is the stuff that we cannot make paper out of, so we'll send it to a different system to get cleaned up. And as you go
go down from all these different tanks, you'll see that the pulp is getting cleaner and cleaner as you go. Hey, is that this newspaper? Yep, this here is the end of the uh, newsprint machine that we've seen earlier. So that uh, material that we just seen over the pulp is actually coming over the end of this machine, and we're going to watch it being made back into new newsprint. Wow. Great. So what we've done, Daniel, is we've made that new newsprint, and here it is rolling it behind you on a finished product, ready to go out again. It really takes a lot of machines to recycle. It sure does. Thank you so much, Daryl, for teaching me how to recycle paper. I learned so much. No problem, Daniel. It was a lot of fun. Thank you. This episode is over, but the very best of my collection is banned on YouTube. To see what you have been missing, go to archive.org and search for Gyro Screw Loose, and I'll see you there. This episode is over, but the very best of my collection is banned on YouTube. To see what you have been missing, go to archive.org and search for Gyro Screw Loose, and I'll see you there.